simple ways to spot skin cancer before it becomes a life-threatening issue Skin cancer usually begins where you can see it therefore it's actually one of the easiest cancers to find Skin cancer can develop anywhere on your skin from the top of your head to the bottom of your feet Even if the area never sees the light of day it is possible to develop skin cancer there You can also get skin cancer in areas that you'd never thought you could Skin cancer can begin under a toenail or a fingernail on your genitals inside your mouth or on a lip You can find skin cancer on your body The best way to find skin cancer is to examine your body when checking you want to look at each spot on your skin And you want to check everywhere from your scalp parting your hair to check your entire scalp to the spaces between your toes and the bottoms of your feet if at all possible it's good to have another person to help examine your body there are many places that you can't see for yourself your partner can examine hard to see areas like your scalp and back if you check your skin on a regular basis you'll be able to see if spots are changing checking monthly can be beneficial if you've had skin cancer your dermatologist can tell you how often you should check your skin skin cancer appears on the body in so many different ways it can look like a changing mole that looks a lot different from other moles dome-shaped growth scaly patch non-healing sore or sore that heals and returns or a brown black streak under a nail it can also show up in other ways you don't have to remember a long list it's time to see a dermatologist if you notice a spot on your skin that differs from the others changes itches or bleeds to make it easy for you to check your skin the AAD created the body mole map you'll find everything you need to know on a single page illustrations show you how to examine your skin and what to look for there's even a place to record what your spots look like you can feel well and still have skin cancer most people who find a suspicious spot on their skin or streak beneath a nail feel just fine they don't have any pain and they don't feel ill the only difference they notice is the suspicious looking spot the spot doesn't have to itch bleed or feel painful although skin cancer sometimes does if you find a spot on your skin that looks suspicious it could be skin cancer and it's time to see a dermatologist found early skin cancer is highly treatable often a dermatologist can treat an early skin cancer by removing the cancer and a bit of normal looking skin if skin cancer has time to grow treatment becomes more difficult skin cancer diagnosis always requires a skin biopsy when you see a dermatologist because you found a spot that might be skin cancer your dermatologist will examine the spot if the dermatologist determines that the spot looks like it could be a skin cancer he or she will remove all or part of it this can easily be done during your appointment the procedure that your dermatologist uses to remove the spot is called a skin biopsy having a skin biopsy is the only way to know if you have skin cancer or not there's no other way to know for sure what your dermatologist removes will be looked at under a microscope the doctor who examines the removed skin will look for cancer cells if cancer cells are found your biopsy report will tell you what type of skin cancer cells were found when cancer cells aren't found your biopsy report will explain what was seen under the microscope if you find a suspicious spot seeing a dermatologist can give you peace of mind dermatologists are experts in caring for the skin and have more experience diagnosing skin cancer than any other doctor don't wait until it's too late if you see something that just doesn't look right to you or has changed since the last time you looked at it find a dermatologist right away